I I thought it was Jungle Pikachu for a second. Pikachu. Welcome back to the channel. We're opening up a new product today that just got released last week, and I'm super excited about it. We are opening up the Cyrus and Clara uh, Premium Tournament Box. Now that's really really long to read, so I'm just gonna kill them. Uh, uh, I'm just gonna call them the Milk Carton because they do look like a milk carton. I believe this is the third release of the Premium Tournament Box. The first one was Marnie. Uh, the second one was the Professor Jupiter. And this time, they're releasing Cyrus and Clara together. Uh, what's different about this one is that if you buy a whole display, the display actually contains two Cyrus and two Clara. Previously, you get a whole display of Marnie or a whole display of uh, Jupiter. So. I'm not sure why they chose Cyrus as one of them. I do love the Clara box though. Um, I wish it would be a more prominent character. So for example, if they if they do the um, the champion, I would love that. Or just other male mm -hmm. characters. But I do love this series. I think they're super collectible. I already have one sealed Marnie and one sealed Jupiter. So I'm very happy to add these to my collection as well. I heard these have amazing, amazing pull rate. So we're gonna go ahead and open these up. Take a look at the content inside, uh, the promos, the sleeves, and we're gonna look at which packs they have and just to test out how are the pull ratios with these boxes. Okay, we're gonna start with Cyrus first. Let's go ahead and crack them open. So this is the Cyrus box right here. The difference with this box though, with the two, uh, two previous ones, the Marnie and the Professor Jupiter, this part is actually hollow and then the inside is from the deck box but this is all printed on right now so you can kind of tell they're still experimenting on these milk carton boxes like maybe like what's the best way to the cheapest way to produce them so there's no no really like um, a set pattern for the boxes yet so right here enforce that boss's order with cyrus so i assume the promo is boss's order Okay, I really hope they have these the uh, signature card in there as well. They had it with the Marnie. They didn't have it with Professor Jupiter. However, they did bring that series back with Crown Zenith. So it'd be really cool if they add that back. I really want them. So here is the dice that comes with every ETB. I have so many dice. I don't even know what to do with it. And then, oh, that's the promo. We're going to look at that last. But here are the sleeves. The sleeves are actually really cool. Right? So it's the same artwork as the cover. Right here you get Gyarados, Cyrus. Right here. I actually don't really like the yellow border. I wish they would make it black. It would I think it would suit the theme better. And then let's take a look at the We all have a Cyrus coin which I don't think anybody is like excited about. He looks just so normal, you know, Cyrus? He, he looks like he's a background character. Like if he doesn't wear, if he doesn't have that boss presence or like wear his outfit, it literally looks like a background character. I, I am not, I'm not a huge fan of um, his design, but this is his deck box. This deck box is horizontal. I think the previous two is more of a vertical. And then we got the, cards in here we got the packs let's see how many packs they have oh this deck box is actually really cool you get sections before you didn't get any sections it was um it was just a uh, open space inside and we get these two coins i'm not too sure what this is i will search up and let you guys know but i think it might be a new mechanic for uh, the new tournament but this deck box is pretty cool you get sections in here and it's a really nice quality. It feels like the good quality of, of uh, plastic. Right here. And per each tournament box, we get one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So same as previous um, tournament boxes, you get seven packs, which is really good. And you get three Silver Tempest. Silver Tempest is definitely an amazing, amazing pack. Fusion Strike, um, Astral Radiance, and a Brilliant Star. All the packs from Sword and Shield are super expensive right now. I think uh, Fusion Strike, if you get a booster box of it, it's probably around like, I don't know, 170, 180 Canadian. So everything's gone on price. And here is the promo 
full art boss's order. Gonna go ahead and crack this open and take a look. I'm so excited for Clara's promo. I think it's gonna look super nice. And here are the co cards. And we got one full R boss's order right here. It's actually this is actually pretty cool. I love the color of it. Team Galaxy. And we got the hollow version of the boss's order, the Black Star promo. But it's too bad that it's not a signed card. I really hope that was a signed card, but it's not. I really want to see Cyrus's uh, uh, his signature because I feel like it'll be pretty badass. But here are the promos. We got one full art, three hollow. We're gonna move on towards the packs. Seven packs. Um, I think if you order these online, they're about forty three plus tax, so close to fifty bucks for each box. If you get seven packs, it's actually not that bad. It's pretty good, pretty good value. We're gonna start with the Astral Radiance. I hope I don't pull anything crazy from Astral Radiance because I got, I think I got all the alternate art from this. I still need alternate art from all the other sets, especially Silver Tempest. It doesn't matter which one. So Quillfish, Reverse Psyduck. This is a great reverse. I love Psyduck as a Pokemon. And Rare Glaceon. It's probably one of the better rares. Glaceon is amazing. And we're moving on to Fusion Strike. Fusion Strike. Personally, I think the best pull is the Gengar alternate art. Some people likes the Mewtwo, the VMAX one. I personally prefer the Gengar one. That's definitely like the prize card for this set. Sharpedo, Heliolisk, Dunsparce, Mudkip, Sanshu. I, I thought it was Jungle Pikachu for a second. Qfont, Impidimp, Snom, and we got a Reverse Skaters Park. Oh, and then we got a Rainbow Rare Sydney. Okay, it's definitely a new card. We haven't pulled this card before. The background is crazy. Look at that. Look at the shine. It looks like he's like doing a combo punching right there. We got a Rainbow Sydney. So this is definitely a secret rare. I hope this is not the only pull we have today. Okay, I, I really want, want some pulls from Silver Tempest. But I'm very happy with a secret rare pull for sure. Gonna open this up. So this is actually um this is another Astral Radiance. I didn't see there's two pack of Astral Radiance. We got Psychic Energy, Gardenia's Viger, uh, Palaswine, Whiskash, Chatot, Magnemite, Teddy Ursa, Sneasel. Mischievous, Reverse Electrode, and we got a V Heatran. We got this Heatran multiple times, I think. But I think it's uh, it's really cool. It looks really cool. Okay, I'm going to cover up Boss's Order because that's that's just a regular hollow. Two hits so far. Two hit with one Rainbow Rare. If on average, you can at least get one really good hit, like Secret Rare or, or you know, just anything better than a V and V Max. Per box, then I think the box is pretty worth. Friends and Galar, I really, really, uh, we are opening up Brilliant Star. This is a Brilliant Star pack. So a chance on the Ultinar Charizard, right? Impidimp, Golette, Cast Form. We open up a lot of these. Uh, the, the set on, oh my god, we got RCS V Star. Yo, okay. this box is actually, the pull rate is pretty good. Pull rate is really good. We got one Secret Rare, one V Star, and one V Card. And this one's a Arceus V Star. Too bad it's not a Charizard V Star. But hey, Arceus is a god of Pokemon. You can never complain about Arceus. Oh my god, Cyrus just fell down. You see that? I think Arceus just punished Cyrus. Because Cyrus is the bad guy. We are down to our last three packs for Cyrus. And this is the Silver Tempest. I still need that Lugia. Okay, I need so many cards in this set. I need Friends and Galar, Full Art, I need Lugia, I need any All Art. But just from looking, just looking at our polls right now, we already got three hits and a one Rainbow Rare. I highly doubt we're gonna pull like a big card out of here. We got Serena, I really want Serena Full Art as well. Rotom, Swirlix, Swablu, Mistrevious, Marini, Reverse Amoongus, and Zygarde. Why can they save 
the major hit in Silver Tempest. Why does Silver Tempest and Lost Origin hate me? I don't understand. Let's see. This is our second pack. Silver Tempest. Dolphin. Fierce Girl. Indeedy. Vampy. Sunkern. Belltoy. Beldum. Reverse. Ferrothorn. And we got a Hollow Rapidash. It's not a shiny Rapidash, but I don't know. That that little shine right there suggests it is, but it's not. It's not blue. Go. So we're on our last pack for Cyrus. Okay, Cyrus, please bless us. Okay, we got a Silver Tempest. Our last Silver Tempest. All I want... Oh my god, I saw the back. Ray, we all see, we all see the back. There's no black hole card, so there's no rare hit. But a good thing about these new sets is that we could still get something on the reverse spot. So you never know. A Bell Toy, and Diddy, Marini, Swirlix, Sandile, Reverse Stun Fix. So okay, I guess there's gonna be nothing. And we got Zorora. Zorora, look at this artwork. This rare artwork is so cool. Oh my god. Straight up look like he's about to use Kame Kamehameha. Okay, right here. So that's it for the Cyrus box. We're gonna move on to Clara. Uh, we're gonna look at Clara's promo card deck box, and we're gonna look. We're gonna try to see if they have the same packs in there. Okay. So this is the Clara box. I actually think most people are after Clara box than Cyrus box because I don't think Cyrus as a character or is that popular. But Clara has some popularity. Of course, she's not the most popular character from Sword and Shield. Um, the Sword and Shield, I think the most popular one is Marnie, but it has some popularity for sure. Look at this. I think the the artwork is super cool. We got a Weezing and Slow King right there. Play like pop star with Clara. Look at that. So Clara's a pop star, hey? Let's see. Come on. Some of these uh, milk cartons, sometimes they... The, the I don't know the stickers or whatever they the glue they use in here is not that good. So when you, when when I buy new one, we see them. It, might, it it looks like it's opened already. I feel like they need to do a better quality control for that. And that's been happening with every single one. Like Marnie has the same problem. Um, the Professor Jupiter has the same problem. So here is the sleeve. The sleeve is actually really cool. I do like the green border with Clara. I think it fits really well. I think either the green or purple would have uh, gone really nicely with this artwork. And let's see what do we get. And we get a Clara coin. This is like a pinkish purple-ish color. Way better than the Cyrus one. And this is the deck box for Clara. Really nice. I really I really like the material they use on these deck boxes. And let's take a look. So you get the same. Not sure what these two is. That that looks like fire. That looks like poison. Might have something to do with the uh, the the types. And same thing. You get you get a section in there. And this inside the section, you get the actual full art of it. It's really really well designed deck box. So if you get this, you can take your cards to a tournament or you know, you can take it to your friend's house to show off your cards. So in terms of packs, I think we get the same pack. We get three Silver Tempest, two Astral Radiants, and one Fusion Strike and one Brilliant Star. So we're going to open up in the same order. But now, what everybody's waiting for, we got the Clara Full Art. Yo, this is a new artwork. I literally thought it's going to be the same Clara Full Art from the previous set, which just has that black star promo stamp on there. But this Clara artwork is amazing, holy. And I think I got a really good promo card too. The centering looks really good from here. Let's go ahead and crack this open and take a look. So here is the code card. And look oh. at this full art, oh my God. I got, this is a really good centered promo. Really, really good centered, at least in the front. But this artwork is so sick. I, you, a lot of people love 
these kind of look from like cartoon or anime girls, you know? Look at that. And from the back, yeah, the back, even the back, the centering looks amazing. I think the top corner, the cut is not the best, but I'm, I think I'm, I'm very lucky. This promo is in, in a pretty good condition, a good centering. The artwork is so much better than Boss's Order. I think the Boss's Order promo, the artwork is recycled. I remember seeing that from previous set. So we got Clara, uh, we got Clara the Hollow promo. Why don't they do the signature card? I don't understand. I think the signature on this one would look so nice. But regardless, this is a really nice promo. The artwork looks really nice. I'm gonna use that to cover up Arceus. And we're gonna start with Astral Radiance. Please, please leave the polls, leave the polls until I open up Silver Tempest, okay? Until I open up Silver Tempest. So we got Lightning Energy, Shield on, Selene, Per Ugly, Glamiel, Yama, Swinub, Nikit, Patil. Oh, we got a we got the Trainer Gallery Gardevoir. Nice. This is our first Trainer Gallery. From the tournament box, this is something we have. Oh, we got a hollow toga toga kiss. Nice. That hollow actually looks really cool. Moving on to our second astral radiance. I I do like Gardevoir and Gallade as a Pokemon. I think the design is really cool. I do like them a lot. Put cards to the back. We got Fighting Energy, Temple of Sinnoh, Ursa Ring, Feather Ball. Quillfish, Growlithe, Bergmite, Rufflet, Ponita, and we got knocked out. Oh my god. I think it's a hit. Please don't do this to me. Like on the back, I, I kind of see a set. Look at that. Look at that. That looks like a gold card to me. Okay, what are we going to get? What are we going to get? We got Temple of Sinnoh for our gold card. But hey, honestly... If you get one secret rare per box, that, that's been what was happening with these boxes, right? I got the Sydney in Rainbow Rare in the Cyrus box, and now I got Gold Card Tempo Sinnoh from Clara box. It's actually really good pull rate. The pull is actually pretty amazing. Got Tempo of Sinnoh right here. I'm going to put it in the back. That actually looks super cool. It kind of looks like a. It, it kind of. If you put it on a Yu Gi Oh card, it would look like the artwork fits into the. The Yu-Gi-Oh card artwork. We're moving on to our Fusion Strike. Oh, they reversed the uh, the co card, so we can We now know that there's no hit in here. Dark Energy, Battle VIP Pass. Uh, I think Silver Tempest just hates me. No matter how many Silver Tempest I, like packs I opened, I just can't get alternate art. We're moving on to Brilliant Star, Alternate Art, or Friends in Galar and Full Art. Oh, okay, there we go. I thought they reversed this as well, but they didn't. That's good. Hey, but Brilliant Stars, I'm I'm told I'll be super happy if I can get the uh, Full Art Charizard, the blue one, or All Art. But I know, you know, the chances are really low because it's it's really hard to get those two cards. Cleansing Gloves, and we got a Dracovish V right here. Okay, so we're going back to the V card. So it looks like I got one V card in the last box and one V card here. I think the pull ratio is actually pretty similar between these two boxes. I got three pulls from the Clara box so far. I think I got three pulls from the last box. Got Leaf Energy. By the way, this is Silver Tempest, our first pack with Silver Tempest. Quadstone, Regenerative Energy, Till, Chinchow, Ferroseed, Pikachu with the amazing artwork right here. Ponyta. Oh, and we got Gardevoir. Oh my god, what's happening? We got double Gardevoir right here from different sets. This is from Astral Radiance. And then we got the Gardevoir from Silver Tempest. I think the Trinidad Gallery Gardevoir looks so much better in the Silver Tempest one because it has the character, the, the character, like the whole thing just looks way cooler. And we got Melotic. 
my god. God of War. This box should be the God of War box. Silver Tempest, give me one hit, please. Friends in Gala. That's not an expensive card. That's probably like a fifty like a $20 card, $20, $30 card. I just want that card. Breaks in Siglif. Rotom. Creepy. Vulpix. Emoga. Chimcho. We got Radiant Alakazam. Okay, nice. We got a Radiant card. And a rare Arcanine. Okay, got a Radiant card. Now, this is our last pack okay, of today's video. We got one more Silver Tempest. Are we gonna have a last pack magic? But just looking at that Clara for art, oh, it makes me so happy. The artwork is amazing. I think Clara box is totally, totally worth it. Right here. Last pack magic right here. It's, th it's gonna be a pull. I can feel it. I can feel it. We always, always have last, last pack magic on this channel. Got Psychic Energy. Lance. Okay, nobody cares about you, Lance. Playing. Crocoroak. Drapey. Come on. Come on. Fletching. Chimecho. Phoebus. Reverse Waylord. Okay, here is it. Here is it. Are we gonna pull something of this last pack? And we got a full art for a side girl. There we go. Yes. What what did I tell you guys, man? Last pack magic is so real on this channel. It always always happens. I am so happy with this pull. I love my trainer in regular for our trainer. I don't really like the rainbow rare. Look at this. If it was rainbow rare, I would have lost on the background. Look how cool. This maple leaf is. Look at that. It even goes into the border right here. My goodness. This is definitely a great pull. I love this card. So that's it for today's packs. Uh, we're going to go ahead. Uh, I'm going to organize these cards. We're going to look at today's pulls. Um, I'm, we're also going to announce last week's winner and also this week's giveaway. A few moments later. The cards has been assembled. I am so happy with today's poll. Let's go ahead and take a quick look. If you add on the promo cards, it is quite a bit of card. So we got boss's orders. Um, I don't know if this is a recycle artwork. I feel like it is because it does seem familiar. So we got three of the boss's orders. And then we got Clara. Personally, I love the, uh, the Clara artwork. Just because the background seems more medieval. Right here. It's really bad. It's really too bad that this is not a signature card. But it is a Black Star promo card. So you can only get this Black Star promo card in these boxes. So we got three of them as well. And then we got the Heat Trend V. It's not our first time seeing him. And same thing, Dracovich V. It's not our first time seeing him as well. And then we also got the Radiant Alakazam right here. One of the Radiant cards. Really nice Radiant cards. And then we got Arceus V-Star. Definitely, definitely a great V-Star. I love Arceus V-Star and also the um, Charizard V-Star. It's too bad it's not Charizard V-Star. And then we got God of War. This is Astral Radiance. This is um, God of War. It's kind of like this doctor or professor's uh, lab partner right here and we got the silver tempest gardevoir this looks so much better you know it gave me a dragon quest vibe but it looks so good look at this artwork love it and then we got our first secret rare that we pull from the cyrus box we got rainbow rare sydney remember sydney the background is really cool and then we got the Tempo of Sinnoh. It's, you know, just because it's a gold card, it really looks like a crazy Rome building, some sort of like God of War, just because it got that gold glisten and also the gold border. It's a really cool artwork, fits really well. So next up is Boss's Borders right here. It, it does feel like recycle artwork. I might be wrong though, because but I do feel like I've seen this artwork somewhere before. 
And then we got our Furious, uh, Furious Old Girl right here. It's an amazing pull. I always love my last pack magic. It's too bad it's not the friends in Galar. But this is definitely one of the um, mo one of the sought after full art from that set as well. And Serena. Serena would be a really, really good full art as well. But Furious Old Girl. And my favorite card from today's video. It's definitely the Clara full art. Look at this artwork. I cannot tell you how much I love this artwork. I think it looks super cool. You can totally see her personality out of this artwork. I think it looks way better. Like her facial expression looks way better than the regular holo, the, like the holo rare. I love this facial expression. Okay, perfect. So that is our hit from today's uh, video. Now, as for this week's giveaway, okay, these are the cards I'll be giving away. I'll be giving away one Hollow Black Star Promo Clara, one Hollow Bosses Water. I'm gonna give away the Dracovish V, Heatran V, the Radiant Alakazam, and we'll also be giving away the Rainbow Rare Sydney. So, one secret rare from today's video is up for the grabs. If you're missing this card in your collection, you know, this is your chance to get it without buying packs. Now, all you have to do is make sure you subscribe to this channel, like the video, and leave a comment down below. Okay, maybe let me know which card you're interested in the giveaway. Uh, that's how you enter for the uh, weekly giveaway, and I do do that weekly, so make sure you follow the content. And as for last week's winner, you guys, you guys are right over here, right here. Now, thank you guys for, all for subscribing and leaving a comment. I do appreciate you guys so much. There is actually quite a bit of new product that just got released. Um, next, as of like recording, next week is going to be a release of Scarlet and Violet set. I'll probably re I'll, I'll make a video of that first. And there's like the Mimikyu Q box. I also want to do another Costco pack like a new pokemon a tin from there so we might put a slight pause on our uh, crown zenith but don't worry we will resume because we still have the premium collection boxes to go okay now thank you all so much i'll see you guys next week